Now at 11, addressing mental health. That's what the Wilmington Sharks did earlier today with the help of two of the biggest advocates for ending the stigma surrounding mental health issues in college sports. WCT's Emma Dolan Mayer spoke to Mark and Kim Holinsky, two parents who lost their son Tyler, who you just saw in that video, in 2018 to suicide. His parents now sharing the message all around the world. While searching for answers after Tyler's passing, Mark and Kim came up with these bracelets that say Holinsky's Hope, which became a message almost every college athlete would soon know. A Tyler talk. It's what Mark and Kim and call the speeches illness. they give to current student so athletes. In Tyler's case, and why we think it's so important to talk to the student athletes, he was the kid that never talked, never asked, never told anybody he was struggling. One day he's playing in a bowl game, and two weeks later, he's not with us any longer. Mark and Kim say Tyler was one of the happiest kids they knew, and a face of struggle was not one he often wore. You know, he loved being on the field. Sometimes he wouldn't want to get out of the car for school or sometimes even at practice. But the minute he crossed over those lines, he seemed to have the best time. We never got any kind of feedback that Tyler was anything but happy, excited and, and wonderful. Tyler's passing and the question marks surrounding what prompted him to shoot himself on January 16th, 2018, is what inspired them to spread awareness about mental health issues in college sports and to reduce the stigma associated with it. It's the one good thing that's been brought upon the most tragic event of the Holinskys' lives. Losing Tyler's changed simply everything for us. Nearly 200 campuses have heard Tyler's story and the message it brings. If we can get up there and share our story about Tyler, it's very emotional, difficult to do. Part of that, part of the reason in doing that is, is to show them it's okay to talk about these subjects. The Holinsky family also continues to make sure they are looking out for one another especially with their youngest son, Ryan, being a current college athlete and needing that extra support. The worry is stronger. The worry is greater. It's it's not the life that I would want anybody to have, but it, it is our truth, and, and we're trying to, I guess, embrace it and, you know, try to, try to live and smile and, and be happy again because our two other sons deserve their mom and dad to be present. Um, it's just very difficult. Everything the Holinskys do now is to make sure the world doesn't lose another Tyler. All of the Sharks were able to hear from Kim and Mark just as I did, and they played knowing they are not alone. Ms. Zollemer, WECT News. And there are local mental health services for you to use if you need help. Coastal Horizons offers individual group and family counseling, as well as peer support services. The organization has offices in New Hanover, Pender, and Brunswick counties. If you're interested, just reach out to one of the offices listed right there on your screen.